Hi, Judy from Witch Peace Craft. Welcome to today's video. Happy Mail! Yee! I have got Happy Mail from my Yanni friend and subscriber, Janet Lupre. It's not the first time she sent me Happy Mail, but wow. And yes, I have opened it. Today is Tuesday and my boss gave me the day off. It's like... Melbourne Cup Day, um, a horse race. I don't want to get into debating the politics of horse racing. Um, for years in my old job, I had to work really hard on Melbourne Cup Day. So it's a bonus when my bosses take the day off. So I did. I'm going to have a seafood lunch because my husband went out to buy some seafood and picked up the mail from the mailbox. Um, and I'm going to spend the day crafting for Emma's charity stall. I may watch the race, I may not, but it's a bonus day to craft. So, happy mail. I don't get a lot of happy mail, but Janet always sends the best. And yes, I have opened it and taken a sneak look. So I got a card from her. Ah, my first Christmas card. Isn't that lovely? That's a lovely card. I'm just going to take five minutes to read it. It's a little personal and um, yeah, it's lovely. She has sent me a Yarny gift, um, holiday gift to create something lovely with. And um, she has some lovely kind words. Hmm. Getting a little teary here. Janet, this is lovely. It's a beautiful card. Thank you so much. So, I think I said in a video, it's really hard in Australia to get like Christmassy yarn that of good quality, unless you buy it online and get it imported from USA or England and it, or sometimes Canada. I have got stuff from Canada and it can be expensive. So, she has sent me premier make the fashion go team in christmas colors i love this yarn everyday premier yarn oh it is so nice and soft oh isn't it amazing look at that beautiful christmas colors we don't get variegated like that here and the quality is really poor and that's fun <laughs> Not much, Janet. Wow. Christmas cotton yarn. The reason I'm laughing is Janet last sent me a big cotton yarn of orange and I made a tea towel. And last night I was looking at my side table and thought, oh, wow, there's still a lot of that left. I could make a table runner, which I need for yarn bingo. Isn't that awesome? Premier cotton. Oh, I love Premier. <laughs> Janet is spoiling me. What's this one? <gasps> Hershner's Worsted 8 Holiday Sparkle. Oh my God, look at that. Isn't that awesome? And I've never had Hershner's yarn. It is soft. Mm. Oh wow. And there's one more little thing in here. Wrap some tissue. Suds and scrub. Hirschner's scrubby yard. Christmas yard. Isn't it all great? Oh my God, Janet. All this holiday yarn. Oh, look, I really appreciate it. But wow, it's not a small gift. And I thank you so much. Um, like I said, I don't often get much happy mail. Australia is so far and postage is so expensive. You don't know how much I appreciate this. Oh, to get these great colours, variegated colours. We can get quality um, one-off colours like red or white and blue and mix them, but I don't like joining that much. I like to get variegated. I have... 
And the reason I was talking about it is I want to make a um, tree skirt. I only have a small Christmas tree, so it'll be a small tree skirt. And I, I wanted to do it in variegated yarn. I didn't want to have to keep joining colours. And this is awesome. Just absolutely awesome. I can see a Christmas table runner for my dining room table. Wow. And maybe, maybe in Sparkle, if I can find one, an elf backpack buddy, a little elf, like elf on the shelf. Because I'm really getting into these backpack buddies, except today I'm giving my hands a rest because they're a bit hard on my hands and doing my table runner. So guys, that's my happy mail from Janet LaPray. Thank you so much, Janet. I... I was absolutely blown away because the parcel I thought he was bringing home was Leah's um, carousel. But she did say that that may not arrive till December or late November because I asked to be put later in the list being away. And um, I will be last on the list before returning it to her. Um, a few things I've been up to since my last video. I have been trying to watch videos to the people I subscribe to which is quite a few I don't just want to subscribe and just be a number to get them over the line or I'd like to actually watch videos and one I watch all the time and have shouted out before but um, has really touched my heart is made by mum Natalie Natalie and her son Jacob are making tea cozies Natalie's making one and Jacob's making one and she's teaching him to crochet and I think that is awesome. Natalie will be entering hers in my make along but not Jacob's. But I suggest you go over there and check it out. It is so great to see this little guy. He's so cute and he's making tea cozies and learning to crochet. Jacob, we are changing the world one tea cozy at a time. And Natalie, thank you so much for sharing that. It's such a lovely video. So guys, check out Made by Mum, Natalie. And it, I think it's just Made by Mum, but her name is Natalie. And I'll leave a link to her channel in the description below. Now, one I've watched way back, but it's not stopped watching, just got shuffled down the list and always says hello to me in live chats, is Sin's Crafting World. Now, she's laid up um, with some health issues and she's doing videos, she does reading, she shares her whips and she's got less than 500 subscribers like Made by Mum. So I'm giving Sin's Crafting World a shout out. Um, head on over there, check out her videos, let her know you're watching. Keep her company via YouTube while she's laid up getting better. I'm sure she appreciate it. I'll put links to her channel in the description below. What a day. My boss gives me a day off because I do work a lot of unpaid overtime and I'm about to go into what he calls out, calls the stretch, the straight to the sh um, scholarships. I have a lot of paperwork between now and the end of December come pouring in to check, verify for scholarships, tertiary education scholarships, university. And he said, why not take Melbourne Cup Day off? And rest up before it all hits your desk come 1st of December, which it will, and some before. Thank you once again, Janet. I love it. Oh, so soft and I can see some projects. And I have never had Hirschner's yarn. Isn't that awesome to get a yarn you've never tried and get it in the colours you've been dreaming of? So much appreciated. Guys, thanks for watching. If you haven't checked out my other videos, please do so. Consider joining our Tea Cozy Make Along. It closes on the 9th of November. And if you check out Jacob's, we'll show you how easy it is to make one. Until next time, thanks for watching. Take care of each other and have a crafty day. Bye for now.